Brett Chaos Peche, once a prominent figure in the Bandidos and Brothers for Life, made a dramatic shift to the Rock Machine MC. His reputation as an enforcer was notorious, often seen in images brandishing a gun, a symbol of his feared persona. But what happens when such a figure faces an unexpected challenge? On a seemingly ordinary day, December 7, 2023, at the bustling Kingsway City Shopping Center, a moment was captured that would pivot the course of Brett Chaos Peachy's life dramatically. The center's CCTV cameras, typically recording mundane daily activities, this time caught a scene straight out of a bikey drama. Peche, known for his tough persona and links to notorious bikey groups, found himself in an unexpected confrontation. The challengers? Two members of the Mongols, Brad Baker and Clovis Chonga. These weren't just any rivals, they were significant figures in the bikey world, making this encounter more than just a casual run-in. The tension was palpable. As Baker approached Peche from one side, Chonga closed in from behind. This strategic positioning by the Mongols was intimidating, to say the least. The air was thick with anticipation. Onlookers might have expected a showdown, a display of the fearlessness Peche was known for. But what unfolded next was startling. In a move that shocked everyone, Peche, instead of confronting or negotiating, made a split-second decision. He pulled out a knife, a clear sign of readiness for a fight. But instead of advancing, he did the unexpected. He turned and fled. This wasn't just a retreat. It was a full-on sprint into the safety of the shopping center, away from the looming threat of the Mongols. This footage, once it hit the internet, spread like wildfire. It wasn't just the act of running that caught people's attention. It was who was running. Brett Chaos Pechi, a man whose reputation was built on fearlessness and strength, was now seen in a completely different light. This viral video didn't just capture a moment of fear. It marked the beginning of a significant downfall for Peche. It was a visual contradiction to the image he had so carefully curated, and it resonated far beyond the walls of the shopping center, into the realms of the bikey world and public perception. But how did the Rock Machine MC react to this display of retreat, especially from someone who portrayed himself as an unflinching enforcer? The answer lies in a decisive Facebook announcement. On January 3rd, 2024, the Rock Machine MC announced that their Perth and South Australia chapters were no longer part of their club. This was a big change, but the most important part of their announcement was about Brett Chaos Peche. They said he was no longer a member and was in bad standing with the club. This decision came after a video went viral. In the video, Peche was seen running away from a fight with members of the Mongols, another motorcycle club, at Kingsway City Shopping Center. For a club like Rock Machine MC, which is known for being tough, seeing one of their members run away from a fight was really embarrassing. Kicking out Peche and saying the chapters he was part of were no longer recognized was a big statement. It showed that the club has strict rules about how its members should act. They want to keep a strong and fearless image, and Peche's actions didn't fit that image. For Peche, this meant he lost his place in the club, and it damaged his reputation in the world of motorcycle clubs, where being tough and respected is very important. Brett Chaos Peche's life has been like a wild ride full of trouble and run-ins with the law, showing how much he was involved in the world of motorcycle gangs. Let's look at the Broad Beach Brawl in 2013. This was a huge fight with the Bandidos, a well-known motorcycle gang. It happened in a busy place, and Peche was right in the middle of it. The fight was so big that he felt he had to leave Australia. So he went to Thailand to stay away from the Australian police. But Peche didn't stay in Thailand forever. After a while, he came back to Australia. Right when he landed, he was arrested. This wasn't a surprise because he had been involved in a lot of illegal activities with the Bandidos and another gang called Brothers for Life. These gangs often break the law, and Peche was a big part of that. Coming back to Australia meant he had to answer for his actions. He was part of the big brawl at Broad Beach and other crimes. The police had many questions for him. This was a big moment for Pecci, as he had to face the results of what he had done. 
Being in the bikey world for Peche wasn't just about being in a gang. It was a life full of danger and often doing illegal things. He was really into this world, and it influenced a lot of his life. His actions with the Bandidos and Brothers for Life showed he was more than just a member. He was a key person in these gangs. During his time with these gangs, Piche got known as a tough guy. He wasn't scared of fighting or doing illegal things. But this kind of life also caused him a lot of problems. From the big fight at Broad Beach, hiding in Thailand, and then getting arrested in Australia, Peche's life has been up and down, mostly because of his deep involvement in the bikey world. The Rock Machine MC is a motorcycle club known all over the world, and they have a reputation for being tough and sometimes getting into trouble with the law. This club follows a strict set of rules and values. They care a lot about how they are seen by others, especially when it comes to being strong and fearless. When Brett Chaos Peachy was caught on camera running away from a fight at the Kingsway City Shopping Center, it was a big deal for the club. This kind of behavior goes against everything the Rock Machine MC stands for. They want their members to be brave and handle tough situations without backing down. Peachy's actions that day showed the opposite of this, and it didn't sit well with the club. This incident didn't just affect Peche's place in the club. It also showed everyone that the Rock Machine MC won't put up with any behavior that makes them look weak or scared. They are very serious about keeping their image as a strong and fearless group. When Peche ran away from the fight, it was clear to the club that he wasn't living up to their standards. This is why they decided to kick him out and make it known that he was no longer part of their group. Brett Chaos Peche being kicked out of the Rock Machine MC is a big deal. It's not just about him losing his place in the club, it's about how quickly someone's reputation can change. Peche was known as a tough guy, but one moment where he seemed scared changed everything. Now, everyone is watching to see what will happen to him next. The big question is, what's next for Chaos Peche? Have you ever witnessed a moment where a single action changed everything? Share your thoughts in the comments below.